So I made a tweet on my Twitter. You guys should check it out. So just tap on the link. It's going to take you to your Binance and make sure you have already updated your Binance app. So Binance also have inbuilt Web3 wallet. So immediately you tap on the link, it's going to take you to your Web3 wallet. It's just like you have Trust Wallet or MetaMask in your Binance. So just create the wallet. Binance did not state anything like we should do this or do that for us to be eligible for the airdrop, but they they signify that there is going to be an airdrop. So what are we going to do? If you like, you can just create the wallet and leave it dormant. But me, what I'm advising you guys to do is to just even deposit at least two dollars and just send it back to your Binance, and I'm going to show you guys how to do that. All you are required to do is just tap on transfer this transfer icon. So just tap on it. So this is how the interface looks like. So all you have to do is just tap on it and select the coin that you want to send to your Binance Web3 wallet. So in this case, I'm going to make use of TRX. As you can see, I have TRX. So I'm going to input the amount that I want to transfer. And kindly note that there are gas fee depending on the network that you are trying to send it. So I'm choosing the BNB chain web 20. So all I have to do now is just input the amount of the TRX I want to send. And that address is your Web3 wallet address so i'm just going to send 32.13 uh, trx so i'm just going to send it as you can see withdrawal is now processing so all i have to do now is to locate my web3 wallet now so just tap on back back so just exercise patience it's not it's not going to take more than a minute or two for your funds to arrive just, like i said you can make use of trx bnb btc any crypto of your choice in this case i'm making use of trx for demonstration so while you're waiting for the TRX to arrive, I'm going to send some USDT as well. For the network, I'm going to make use of the BNB chain since the network fee is just $0.19. I'm just going to tap on confirm, then tap on transfer. And you know that you are going to need BNB to transfer your assets from your Web3 wallet back to your Binance exchange wallet. So as you can see, I've now received my TRX and USDT. You can even leave it here. You don't have to fear or do anything. Your assets are safe. So all you have to do now is you just send it back to your Binance wallet or you can keep it there. So if I want to send it back to my Binance, all I have to do now is you just tap on deposit and just search for USDT. And you know we made use of the BNB chain network to transfer the assets. So I'm just going to tap on BNB chain BEP20. Then I'm just going to copy my wallet address. Then I'll head over back to my Web3 wallet and just send this from there. So just tap on Web3 at the top. So I'm now just going to send the USDT back to my Binance wallet. So all I have to do is just tap on it. Then I'm going to input the amount I'm willing to send. So I'm not sending all. I'm just going to leave like $0.1 or any amount. Then I'm just going to transfer. As you can see, there's transfer error. They said insufficient BNB to pay for the gas fee. So you are going to need BNB to cover up the transaction fee because the assets are on BNB chain network. So we have to get some BNB. So I've now gotten $0.2 of BNB, so I'm just going to transfer it now. Similarly, you can get BNB from your Binance, just transfer it the same way you transfer TRX. I've input the wallet address, I'm just going to input the amount, then I'm going to send, review. The transaction fee is not even up to $0.1, so it's very, very low. Just review and send, and that's pretty much it. You are going to receive your deposit within 10 minutes, 5 to 10 minutes, and that's pretty much it. Similarly, for the TRX, if you want to send it back, you can make use of the same wallet address since they are both on the BNB chain network and just send it. So that's pretty much it. Or you can head over to your Binance, tap on deposit, search for TRX, and select the BNB chain network, BEP20, and send it. Or you can even make use of the same wallet address. You can even make use of same wallet address to make the transfer. As you can see, I made the same. I made use of the same wallet address. I'm just going to input the amount. I have 32, so I'm just going to send 31. I'm just leaving like a small residue inside the Web3 wallet. I don't want it to be empty. Then I'm just going to send. You can make use of $1,000, $10,000. They don't. They don't state any criteria for the airdrop, but make sure you just interact with the wallet. Maybe you can get some airdrops in the future. So that's pretty much it.